Good morning, my friends. It's Saturday, December 19th, and I'm here with you at the Rising of the Sun, Kate. And my cat, I think, is clawing the rug. <laughs> but let us light our Advent wreath together this morning. Come to us, light of the world. Enter our hearts in this Advent season. And I have with me the things that help me pray, St. Francis. Jesus. Jesus. And Mary and the baby. We turn now in these final days of the season of Advent to the prophet Isaiah, one of the most well-known and beloved of all the prophets of the scripture. Isaiah lived in the 700s before Christ. He lived in the Southern Kingdom. Isaiah had a vision in which a seraph, which is the highest of all the angels, comes and puts a hot coal on his mouth. And God says, who will I send? And Isaiah says, send me. Isaiah would be one of the primary prophets to foretell the coming of the Messiah. And so often his, his prophecies are read during the Advent season and Christmas season. What is a prophet? A prophet is someone who interprets what God is doing we tend to confuse prophets with soothsayers or future tellers, fortune tellers. That's not what they were. They were trying to tell the world what God was already doing and would do. So in a sense, anyone who prays, anyone who tries to discern the movement of the Holy Spirit can be a prophet if you're willing to tell others what you feel is happening. All of us could say, here I am, send me. All we have to ask ourselves in prayer is, God, what are you saying to the people of this earth today? If Jesus could speak to us, what would he be saying? And then to not be afraid to go and share that with others. What would Jesus tell us now? Hold on, have patience, the vaccine is coming make this Christmas a special time, a time to spend with me. Maybe God is saying, why won't you treat my earth with love and respect? Whatever it is you believe that God may be saying to us, you can tell others. It's a dangerous thing though, to interpret God and we have to be very careful dangerous, treacherous, but also it makes God the most important person to you and to others. Are you a prophet? Could you be one? Here I am, Isaiah said, send me. Let us pray. Almighty God, you are coming to us more and more as the days darken. And soon we will see a cosmic event that we haven't seen for hundreds of years on December 21st. We thank you for the movement of your Holy Spirit in this world. Help us to understand what it is you're telling us, knowing that your voice is always the voice of love. Give us courage to speak into the world a message of hope and love, a message that will help others draw closer to you. We thank you for the courage of Isaiah and the prophets. Guide us, Lord, and thank you for this vaccine. Give us patience as we await its arrival. 
As we prepare for the birth of Christ, help us to reach out in love to others. Bless the sick, the suffering, the dying. Bless those who do not have much at Christmas time or who are alone. Watch over this earth, Lord. Help us to know you. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. God bless you and have a great day.